Hey everybody, welcome back to Fish According to Steve. Today I'm going to show you a little video on my indoor Lake Tanganyika pond. It's a, a stock tank basically to help water your stock animals on a farm. But I've added a pond liner to it to help reduce the, the potential for leaking. And as you can see, it is quite large. I've got river rock on the bottom to break up the surface, the bottom surface. The sand down there is actual seabed sand to help raise the pH. And in here I've just got a variety of Lake Tanganyika fish. I've got a Trophius or two. I've got the Frontosa. I've got six of those. There's the Marliari right there. There's two of those in here. There's the other guy over there. And today I'm just going to show you how much these fish love to feed on mysis, P.E. mysis shrimp pellets. P.E. mysis shrimp pellets are great for um, Lake Tanganyika fish. They're made of shrimp and basically that's one of the favorite diets of Tanganyika fish. So here we go, I'm going to do a little feed here. You can watch the front toes, just go nuts for it. And the dither fish, of course. But as you can see, oh, you saw a calvus there too. Yeah, I've got one calvus in there. But here's the front toes, they're just scooping it up. They love this food. And once again, it's pretty much a pinch or two. And they just love it. And that's basically all I feed them each day is two pinches of the P.E. Mysis pellets, the shrimp pellets. And that's the bag right there. Very handy. Not hard and crunchy like other pellets. Denatured because it's overcooked. They're soft to the touch. You could squish them in your fingers. And the fish love them because they're made of great ingredients main one being mysis shrimp from Lake Okanagan. Alright, once again, that's Fish According to Steve, and that's my indoor Lake Tanganyika Pond.